the Mad Life First Review Russian Tower Journey of Lena! Yeah! Whoa! So, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for another first impression reaction, and this time we're watching a magical girl show. Well, more of a witch show, I would say. Well, you can say I've been told not to sleep on this show because, you know, it's all about a girl trying to develop her skills over time. Hence, why is the, the title is called Journey of Elena, Majo no Tabi. So, she's going on a journey to improve our witchcraft skills, I guess. And when I saw the PV for this, well, show itself, oh my god, guys, I am digging the animation, man. Oh my god, it's so beautiful, too. And of course, the character design. Love it, man. I love the character design. Oh my god, dude. I think I'm gonna love this show, man. Because, like, I, I love cute girls. I love, you know, girls being badass and basically doing witch stuff. And most importantly, my favorite voices of Kana Hanazawa is voicing one of the characters in this show. Oh my god, I just can't wait to watch this show already because I heard many good things about the show from those who I think read the light novel for this or was it the manga? But I don't really care about the source material. I'm just going to this blinded and see what to expect from this show. And I can tell you guys this, this could be my, well, hidden pleasure show for this season man maybe this is gonna be like the under ratio for this season and the hidden gem for this season so oh my god just can't wait to check out the first episode and see what's it all about man so without further ado let's get started shall we okay we should and let's get started shall we okay let's just see whether this show will be my hidden gem for this season and well other than the fact that i'm gonna be cute girls maybe there's some interesting magic casting moments in this show too so without further ado here we go three two one go Aha! Wow, seems like we get to see the root of her passion. She loves reading books. And with reading books, she did discover magic, I presume. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So she reading a book about Nikkel. Oh, interesting. Okay. Um, I think that's the wish that we're going to see later in this episode. <laughs> Just like Nikkel. Yeah, sure, why not? And that's how she become a witch. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hmm? <laughs> Only after you bigger and have become a witch. So become a witch, that's the primary aspect. Become a witch. I do wonder whether the parents would change the decision on that though. Say, yeah, it's too dangerous for you. That'd be very ironic. Mm-hmm. And <laughs> the father is like, oh shit. She might don't want to become a daughter of witch. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, so she's been studying over and every day, day after day. But I uh, was she successful? Well, we shall see, of course. I mean, she studies every day, though. Then, in a peaceful country of Roberta. Mm -hmm. Wow, 14 years old and she passed one of the exams to become a witch. Damn. That's persistence, everyone. That is persistence right there. Apprentice witch Elena. <laughs> wow, she became a witch. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow, because she's been studying every day. That's the wholesomeness of this, man. No! <laughs> <laughs> wow, she's being cocky, isn't she? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, so she needs to be accepted from a, a actual witch to be the apprentice, and then you can become a witch. So that's like a final process. It's like it's like being a doctor. You need to go to residency and then become an actual doctor. That sort of thing. You study, and now you have to become an apprentice. So she's like look, going around looking for like tough witches to work under. Oh yo, she's so good looking already. Not interested in the law. <laughs> Wow, that was instant. <laughs> Seems like they're not interested in apprenticeship right now. Not interested! <laughs> Yeah, since like they're not interested in like um Since like they're not interested in like interested in apprenticeship uh, as well as the fact that she's too young. Mm-hmm. Well maybe she's too young, maybe because she's just I don't know. Something about her, man. Maybe or maybe they're just too busy to be having apprenticeship. Well, look deeper. 
Mm-hmm. A dodgy witch, huh? Mm-hmm. A star just witch. A dodgy witch. And let me guess. She will be the sensei. She will be the sensei. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And she found it. Could that be her? Oh, there we go. There she is. Messing around. <laughs> Playing around <laughs> butterflies. Wow, okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I think that's kind of Hanazawa. Yep, I think that's kind of Hanazawa voice act, uh, voicing that character. <laughs> no, no confidence in her at all. Yeah, you're just not gonna run away, are you? Yes, she's the only option left, man. She's the only option left. Maybe she's strong, though. That's the thing. Maybe she's strong. Alright. Ah, la la la! Oh, she knew. Wow, she knew. Damn. For better or worse. I think for worse because like now we just turn her down because she's too good, I guess. <laughs> so your business. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I don't mind. Oh, there you go. Yes. Huh? The reaction though. <laughs> I spare time, anyways. Yeah, you. Yeah, you. Now accept it, man. She has sued. That was she accepted you already. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, she she did. She found a sensei. She found a sensei. <laughs> mm hmm. I gotta say, I think this sensei could be my favorite sensei, man. Fran sensei. Fran Sensei, I think she's gonna be my favorite Sensei, man. I, I can tell because not only because she's been boys at Kananazawa, but also because of her personality. Mm hmm. <laughs> what? <laughs> Steak for breakfast? Hmm. Wow, see? Her personality is enough to get me to like her already. <laughs> She's like one of those cheerful, like clumsy ones, I presume. But maybe deep inside, she's actually really strong. We'll just see. That's for later. I'll be going. Wow. First day of lesson, and then she. Wow. Okay, so he's simply telling her to self-study most of the time, or oh, she's just using her as a, like a personal maid. I have a feeling she's using her as a personal maid or something. I don't know. I have a bad feeling about this. Dude, she's a maid right now. Wow. Is that how you treat your student? Oh wow! Is this training or is this using uh, abusing her or teaching her social skills? I don't know, man. Yo! Woo! Yes! Woo! Wow! Really, spider? Mhm. Mm yeah, she starts to figure out that this is not training. This is abusing her. I always mix in. <laughs> mm hmm. <laughs> is mushroom that bad though? I like mushrooms, by the way. Dude. This is not training. This is teaching. This is using her as a maid. Maybe that's teaching her some like all the skills of witches. Maybe I don't know. I'm trying to be optimistic. She's not answering her. Oh, ho, 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 ho. 
Ah! <laughs> a month have passed and nothing been taught. What the hell has she been doing this past? Exactly, isn't it? Always been chores. Hmm. Oh. Oh. Wow. Okay. She's gonna be pissed. Oh my gosh. When will she snap, man? You, you know. Hmm. Fight me? Oh, test. Okay, that's oh a test. Already? Like, no teaching and you're testing her already? Like, was it some sort of like, um, skill test? Oh my god, you have to fight her. Oh my god. Really? She's not she's serious. She's motherfucking serious. Oh my god. She's motherfucking serious. Oh, she's not gonna let. Oh, ho, ho. She's not letting down, man. She is not letting down. Off we go. Ooh, ho, ho. Oof. Oof. Oh, man. Okay. Okay, she is strong. Despite being a clumsy witch. I was just say a carefree witch. And that sm that gives up a, a creepy smile most of the time. Well, she's serious at least. I mean, I think that's the point, get her to be serious. Oh, ho ho! Oh my god, the after effect, man. That's just strong. Oh, wow, I have to say, I'm, I'm digging the animation already. Not bad, indeed. Oh, ho! Oh, ho, ho! Nice! Oh, my God. She is strong. She is strong, man. Ooh. Ouch! Dude. Come on, man. This is how you treat your students after like no month of training. Is she like teaching her? Is she some sort of like a secret test that teach her about isn't this more than just like magic that you're teaching her or something? Oh my god, I've dude. She's trying to. He's almost actually trying to kill her, man. They have one bad move, then she's dead. Please entertain me more. Oh my god, she's not too happy about how she counter her magic. Oh. Yeah, so much for being like the top entry, top examinee to finish the test of top score. So it seems like she's teaching her that it's not all about like exam and stuff like that. It's all about practical skills and experience. So she's teaching her the hardship of being a witch, I guess. Oh, and that's your last. Oh my god, see, she's teaching her not to be cocky, I guess. On the students, no, no use, man. Oh my god. Just let it out already. Just let it out already. Mm hmm. Hmm. Maybe she starts to realize how weak she is, despite having top score. Hmm. 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 Not now, man. My God. I think she lacks people skills. By the way, I have a feeling she lacks people skills. The sensei.
<laughs> Dude, nothing gonna cheer her up, man. <laughs> Jesus Christ, she's making fun of herself. Remember, she's still 14 years old. Yes! Hmm. Hmm. Having fun. Hmm. Oh yeah. All the feelings of this past month we let down, man. No training and then she's just abuse her like that. I can understand why she's like crying man. Hmm. Wow, okay. Strong development already. I mean she just just wants to be trained and be Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Huh? Huh? Oh, oh my god, okay, not for free, <laughs> money, take it, <laughs> how troubling, <laughs> wow, well, then why you take the money then, oh, so it's the parents that want the teacher to lecture her daughter, Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. She want her to teach her like there's more than just being a very cocky wish. Teach her the the harsh reality. Mm -hmm. I see. Hmm. Be true to yourself. Not teaching you magic up to now was to teach the thing you dislike. Your limit. <laughs> it took a month. So she was testing her limit, huh? Mm -hmm. Wow, okay. Don't bear it. Release it. Mm-hmm. Yep, experience. Oh my god, so this past few months just to test her limit, test her uh, mental strength. Weed. <laughs> Not to bear with it. <laughs> Not to bear with it. Just release those angers. <laughs> mm. Hi. <laughs> Hello, best sensei. Mm -hmm. Wow, well, finally some proper training. Mm -hmm. Well, at least they start to develop this sensei and student bond now. Mm -hmm. 
I didn't say her hat can have stars on it. Hmm. Oh, ho ho, nice. Oh ho, nice one. Yep. See you good. Nari Basta. Mm -hmm. One year already? Wait, one year already? Wow, that, that was fast. One year already. So is she like a full fledged? She... Oh my god, so she's an official witch now? I thought her journey is to become a witch in just one episode. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that, so that's a basic name though. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. <laughs> Why not, I guess. It's fine, that will do. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah. Still, I find that we name kind of weird to be honest. Dude, in the span of one episode. Wow. I mean, might as well get the cliche training arc done, I guess. From a certain country. Oh, really? Okay. Who? You? Oh, so she's hanging back home? Okay. Wow, she's hanging back. Uh, yeah, one year passed, man. Sensei's doing bond. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> wow, okay. <laughs> Back to normal tree. <laughs> so is this the season finale or something? Cause it seems like it. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh. Now she wanna go on a, a journey. Oh wow, okay. Three things I want you to promise us. Three things. Um, obviously. Do not think that you're a special human. Yep, that's important by the way. Don't, th yeah, think, don't think too highly of yourself. Come back for sure one someday. Hmm. The third thing is like a, a doable option, I guess. So what is she like keen on a tabby now? She's going off on her journey to learn some new experience, learn some new powers. <laughs> well, it's like going to university basically. Dude, it's like she's going to university. That's the sort of feeling the parents have when kids say, I've gone on a journey. Okay, sure. Uh, come to think of it, she has a skeleton in her room. Holy shit, that's creepy as fuck. Uh, oh my god, it's like the kids go to university. That's so feeling. <laughs> Off she goes on her journey. Mm -hmm. So does she have a goal in mind? 
So does she have a goal in mind with this journey? Wait, she's 18 already? Wow, that was fast. Majo not Tapi, the journey. <laughs> wow. What can I say? Get rid of the whole cliche training arc and get the whole journey begins. So, oh my god, this episode 1 just felt like it could be lasted for like 3 episodes long, but they kind of condensed it to like 1 episode. I mean, I think they cut out a lot of stuff in the light novel too, but I think this is like a very um well good start to the season at least we know that elena it doesn't like just become a, like a very arrogant witch by saying oh my god i'm on top of everyone i need to go and find the sensei and then the parents man fair play for the parents are asking the sensei to teach the door some manner some uh, life lessons some limitations and and of course do not bear with it release it so yeah i mean at first she thought that she's like one of the top students but yes not ever just because you're a top student doesn't mean you're gonna be like the best of the best you always have something to learn in life like yes there are smart people but smart people the reason why they're smart is because they learn and they learn from mistakes so yeah this is why this parent asked uh, you know france and say to teach her all those life skills so fair play for the parents and of course france they say try her best to be a very strict um teacher yet you know the way she kind of overdid it though in the training though and kind of like forced her to do a lot of chores but that's like some good life lesson for elena showing that you need to learn to like bear with many situations and of course release them when you feel strained from it so that was some a good training art between france and, and elena and i'll just say that was some good development between sensei and student although i would wish to see more of that in like in two episodes rather than one episode they kind of fast fast pace it but at least we get a general idea how strong their relationship uh, been built over time within one year and she's 18 now for some reason i, mean, I think it was like 14 when she mentioned the start of the episode so well what can i say now elena is going on a journey basically keen on a to learn some new experiences to be a witch going around helping people maybe and meeting new people i'm pretty sure she'll meet francis there again and she learned the truth about francis maybe she's secretly the witch that she uh, aspired to be or something like that but who knows man anything can go in this story because i never read the light novel and i'm not sure how many of you guys watched or read actually read the light novel but i'm actually really enjoying the show so far especially the fact that francis there is being voiced by one of my favorite voice actors i think she's been voiced because I kind of recognize the voice and so yeah, Elena is on a journey now basically fitting very fitting to the title journey of Elena and she's on her way meet new people be friendly with people fix situation fight monsters using her uh, all her taught lessons with Francis to you know use it for good so yeah you can say she's a really talented witch right now and now all she now needs is experience and this is what she's doing right now so yeah i'm not bad i'm loving the animation i love how they use the magic casting and stuff like that and most importantly beautiful character design i love the character design by the way Dude, I'm digging the character design. She, they are beautiful. All the girls in the show is best girl over it already. But Francis say, personal favorite. So what you guys think of this show? Do you think it's gonna be like the sleeper of the season? Do you think it's gonna be like um a very how to say um so sort of like uh how to, uh, I don't know, I, don't know, I would say it's like a, a guilty pleasure show. I say it's more like a hidden show for the season that people kind of miss out because of the whole cute girls traveling but i think i'm gonna enjoy the show a lot so depending on the reception i get for the show for this episode i may continue reacting to it but for now i'm giving this a, a second episode impression so first episode impression second episode impression after second episode impression then i'll say yep i'm gonna do this every week from now on so next week will be like another deciding factor whether i want to continue reacting to the show so with that said hope you guys enjoy reaction smash the button enjoy your reactions as every time see you or something i guess then